Hello viewers, welcome to linuxhelp.com. Today we are going to see how to install a CabOut monitoring tool using a docker. Before that, let me give a short intro about CabOut. CabOut is an open source self-hosted monitoring platform written in Python language that provides with you some of the best features and also it provides a web interface that allows you to monitor services and also send telephone SMS and email alerts to your support in case of any service failures. In this tutorial, we will explain how to install this CabOut monitoring system on a CentOS 7 server using a Docker Compose. So let's proceed with the installation. You can install Docker using this command. Now the installation has been complete. Once the installation is complete, make sure you start and enable the Docker service. Now let's check the status of the Docker. So it is active and running. Now enable it. It is now enabled. Docker Compose is a command line tool to define and configure multi-container Docker application. In other words, it is used to link multiple containers and deploy application from a single command. So you can use these steps to install Docker Compose. First, use a EPEL release for installing Docker Compose. and then install a python pip now let's install a docker compose Please note that pip version 6.0 or higher is recommended for Docker Compose installation and also to work smoothly. The next step will be installing the JIT. We can install a JIT packages from the repositories by just running the following command. It says the latest version is already installed. So let's deploy a CabOut container using a Docker Compose tool. In order to do, do that, please run the following command. To deploy our CabOut container tool with Compose command, first we need to have a directory with the name which includes the Docker Compose file, namely docker-compose.yml. which defines the services for our application and container images. So this is the way to download the CabOut repository from GitHub for building our container. Now it is added and finally you can run the docker compose command to build your container. Use this following command. But before that, this will create our CabOut folder with all required files to create our container. Now we have to move our CabOut folder created and then add keys for external services to the configuration file using the production.env example and develop.env example. In order to do that, if you go here, you can find those files. So just copy those con of production.env example to production.env now this will be copied and then copy the development.env.example file to development.env
and finally you can now run the docker compose command to build your container So once it is done, make sure you have Kabbat container and its services are running by using the following command. So this shows that our Kabbat container is running. That's it. We have Kabbat monitoring tool up and running. Now you can access it from web interface using the web URL. Now type your IP address or your host name in the URL. Now you can see the following interface here. When it is launching for the first time, we have to create an email and password. And then click the create. After creating the account, you have to log in using the created ID. So now we are logged into the interface. All the configuration takes place through environment variables managed by Foreman. So this is how you install a cabot monitoring in the center is on in the upcoming videos we will see how to configure and add a host here and then we will see how to add new users thank you for watching this tutorial hey, if you like our channel please don't forget to subscribe for more videos please do visit www.linuxhelp.com and also mail us to support at linuxhelp.com for further queries